welcome all of you in this topic we will cover how to create gradient button in android okay in the last topic we have already discussed about how to create circular button in android okay uh, before watching this video uh, you have to see my previous video why because maximum concepts that are uh, used to create gradient buttons some of the steps are already discussed in the last video the first question is uh, what is mean by gradient gradient is the background uh, which is filled by multi color options if you want to apply multiple colors to the background of same button uh, for that we have to use gradient okay after applying your gradient color the button will be look like this okay see okay so in this way we can apply multiple colors to the same button okay now we will see how to create such a multiple color button or gradient button in android practically okay for that uh, start your studio i have already created my button in the last video uh, because in last video i have already discussed what is been by button tag and some of the basic attributes okay now the button is ready with the caption click me now i have to change this button with multiple colors okay so the procedure is so for that go to this drawable folder just right click on it and select new drawable resource file fine you can specify any name whatever you want here i specify background as a file name okay then change your selector with the shape tag so you can apply circular button shape as well as multiple color options with the same file fine click on this okay button once you click on this okay button you will see uh, your drivable resource file is now ready so for the shape tag we have one attribute with the name shape that is already discussed in the last video shape and then select oval so we can specify circular shape for your button and now instead of solid color in the last video we have applied solid color it means uh, we feel that particular shape is a single color but now i have the requirement of multiple color if you want to say it multiple color it means if you want to say it gradient colors to your background then you have to use that gradient tag instead of solid fine select gradient here we can specify three colors as per your requirement okay so the first attribute is start color so the first attribute is start color okay here you can specify any color whatever you want fine you can see the reflection in the right side the second color is the second attribute is center color it means the color which is applied to the center okay uh, here i change my color combination code here and after that i set my last color that is nothing but end color and uh, some values are there okay if you see these three colors are not perfectly uh, belongs to any gradient option if you specify some random values for start color center color and end color attribute then you will not get whatever you want you can select any color whatever you want for that just click on this dot in the left side okay select the first color as a red okay fine to change our center color click on this second dot option and then select opposite color whatever you want suppose i have selected here white option fine and then if you want to change the last to the dark green color then you can select this yes, green option fine okay the structure is now ready so in this way we can apply gradient or multi colors to the same background but if you want to change the orientation for that we have one more attribute with the name angle okay if you specify here a values like 270 that angle will be changed from 270 degree okay instead of selecting three different colors uh, you also uh, you have one more option that you can select any one color uh, like this if i select here white color first option and then after that uh, second is a uh, little bit blue okay and after that the third option is dark blue okay so these buttons are also attractive okay so as per your requirement you can change your shade whatever you want and specify uh, such a background color with the help of gradient tag and then these four attributes fine 
now i have created the shape and gradient color mixture in a background.xml file now i have to use these options in my activity underscore main file button okay so i have to change the click me button background uh, like your gradient color whatever you have specified in background.xml file for that once again we have to use background attribute okay and the value for this background attribute is your file name and the file name is background okay so here the first option is loaded in front of you at the rate drawable indicates that the file is present inside your drawable folder slash background means your file name and hit enter you can see your button is now ready okay so in this way you can easily create gradient button in an android thanks for watching this video have a nice day